It's been so exciting to meet Kings fans and see their energy and the spirit that they've had throughout the playoffs. And the fandom spends well beyond California. Yeah, Luke, it really does. Some of the youngest Kings fans are more than 3,000 miles away. ABC 10 talked with one man from El Dorado Hills who brought love for the Kings all the way down to Nicaragua. You talk about Kings fans. We have one of the, uh, obviously, we're the best Kings fans in the in the world. I mean, the, we're the best fan base, NBA, no doubt on my mind. Edson Mitchell from El Dorado Hills says he started volunteering in Central America shortly after his son Michael died in 2004. It's kind of a, it was a very sad, a very tragic part of my life. He was my firstborn, and he was a, a big time Kings fan. Despite struggling with that loss, he managed to take something they both loved and spread it to another part of the world. After keeping busy with work, Mitchell traveled to Nicaragua in 2006 and met the children and others in the area and started the Gracias Jesus nonprofit. I'm 82. I work out every day. That's I do, wonderful. I do, I do 10 miles a day, every day on the oh elliptical. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, you gotta do it. You gotta keep moving. The group buys school uniforms and helps feed children in rural areas and teaches English. One of the things he helped do was renovate a basketball court at a school there. The basketball court was a disaster, total disaster. So what we did, we well, we got the all the the, the men and the kids all together, and we tore up part of the uh, basketball court and we refixed the whole basketball. He made sure the backboards were plastered with Sacramento colors. Mitchell says ever since, all of the kids who go to that school became Kings fans. They've even been following along through this playoffs run. He wants the Kings to know the kids are proud of them no matter what happens. You got kids watching you from Nicaragua. Give me a break, you know. You're so blessed. With, we are so blessed what we have. It's amazing what we have. <laughs> Love them. Edison also says he would like to expand the organization to include more students. They would like to take high schoolers to visit the kids in Nicaragua in the hopes of friendship, learning, and cultural exchange.